in my world, when I perform my music, I don't really talk. <laughs> Because uh, I think of my music as something that takes people away to somewhere else. So me saying things like, hi, my name is Yoko, to me it's a way of bringing everybody back to this reality. And I'm kind of excited today because it's not something I'm not used to. And that's why I have my notes with me. <laughs> Today, I'm going to take you away just for a moment. And I'm going to bring you right back. Just a small introduction to you, to the type of music that I do, that I call organic electronica. Organic electronica. <laughs> electronic music is fascinating to me because to me it has a potential to embody contradictions and harmonize differences. And this notion of contradiction captured me. The hybridity, hybridity of digital and analog machines and humans singing together. It's all about innovation, designing sound, designing on instruments, but rooted in tradition because I've been classically trained. Logic of production to capture emotion in soundscape made with technology but sounding like nature. The alchemy of contradictions. I aspire for my music to be the elixir of harmony. Building a capacity to embrace contradictions and value differences. I believe it is important to build this capacity for our survival as human beings and for our happiness too. 
So today, I'm going to show you how music can build this capacity within us. And I will do so by sharing how I experienced music as a language, but in two unique ways. I'm also going to ask you to participate in this ongoing music composition because having your voice is important. My interest in dealing with contradictions actually let me study conflict resolution here at the George Washington University. And during my studies, I attended a conference on international mediation in Cape Town, South Africa. And there I met a friend from Rwanda whose father is Futu and mother is Tsuchi, two ethnic groups that were in conflict during the genocide in 1994. My friend shared with me his story of life that he witnessed his father's people killing his mother's people. All through his life, he kept asking this question, who am I and why? And at last he answered this question for himself and for anyone aspiring to be a bridge. And this is what he said. We are the proof that love does exist across ethnic divisions. We are the proof that love does exist across ethnic divisions. I was so moved, not just by this statement, but by the fact that this had to come from somebody growing up struggling in such a situation, that I knew that I had to find a way to spread this idea, making it into something universal so that everyone can somehow relate by doing what I do, organic electronic music. So I began sharing his story and asking people of different cultures to translate and record this phrase in their own language. So far, his statement has been recorded in 20 different languages, which I continue to weave into a soundscape. I received a grant from DC Art Commission and started to share this piece at universities and galleries, working with organizations like Meridian International Center, which focuses on cultural diplomacy. Now, please raise your hand if you are from somewhere else or in some way or other speak language other than English. Great, great. Thank you. Well, with the help of a few people I met today, I'd like to show you how it works. <laughs> but in the meantime, I'd like you all of you to start thinking how you'd translate this statement in your own language, or if you don't speak other language, how you'd translate this statement into your own life. Thank you for participating. Excuse me. Okay, one second. Vi har beviset på, at kærlighed eksisterer på tværs af etniske skæld. Thank you. Thank you. Vi har beviset på. Nós somos prova de que o amor existe através de divisões étnicas. Thank you. Thank you very much. Now, let's just listen for a moment. Nós somos prova de que o amor existe através de divisões étnicas. 
Nós somos prova de que o amor existe através de divisões étnicas. What's your first reaction when you hear some foreign language? I don't exactly understand your language, so my first reaction would be I shut down myself automatically. See, language is very interesting because it's a tool of communication, but it can divide us sometimes. And when we speak the same language, it could be even worse. <laughs> When I first came to America, I did not quite understand English, so for a while, I had no idea what people were saying. For me, as a little Japanese teenager not knowing anybody in this foreign land, the only way for me to survive was somehow to develop this instinct to grasp how people are saying what they are saying. Tone in voices, because gestures can be culturally specific too. Does this voice sound like this person is being honest, or is he trying to trick me? It was the tone in voices that I found to be universal, which became the language that I started to interpret as opposed to the literal content of spoken English. This confusion and struggle humbled me. It opened up a new way to appreciate this underlying tone that I, have, I was often too busy to take notice. And in turn, it allowed me to start connecting to people in a language that transcends language. Music. Now let's go back to listening again. But this time, pay attention just to the tone of these voices, please. Nós somos prova de que o amor existe através de divisões étnicas. See if. There's anything somos prova in the hands of a unifying They speak different languages, but notice that they are all talking about the same idea, sharing the same underlying tone, the seed my friend planted. We are the proof that love does exist across ethnic divisions. And my friend continued, this is our hope, our optimism that will one day change the world. And now the phrase, music is a universal language, may not be a cliche. Nous sommes le fruit d'un amour entre différents groupes ethniques, quels que soient les conflits qui les opposent. We are proof that love does exist across ethnic divisions. Nous sommes certains et nous croyons que. Que That 
Nós somos prova de que o amor existe através de divisões étnicas. Nós somos prova de que o amor existe através de divisões étnicas. Nós somos prova de que o amor existe através de divisões étnicas. Nós somos prova de que o amor existe através de divisões étnicas. Nós somos prova de que o amor existe através de divisões étnicas. Nós somos prova de que o amor existe através de divisões étnicas. Nós somos prova de que o amor existe através de divisões étnicas. Nós somos prova de que o amor existe através de divisões étnicas. Thank you. What I wanted to leave with you today is a little glimpse that music can help us to transcend language, our cognitive barriers, and how many differences within us. And I believe that building this capacity to embrace contradictions is a key for us to stay human and to our happiness. Along with this organic electronica, because it's the alchemy of technology, obviously, so I covered tea, uh, design, it's not just the design of soundscape, but it's about redesigning our perception about the world, about how we can relate to one another. Let's redesign our expectations of what might be possible. It's the elixir of harmony, and I hope it was entertaining. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.